guys, here more the Geek. In this video, I want to share with you guys on how to screen capture your gameplay or go stream live on YouTube playing Android games using the new YouTube gaming app. I just uploaded a video today, which is, um, let me see if I can find it here. It's, um, uh, la 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 la. <laughs> I'm just doing this video to show you guys. I uploaded a video today called YouTube Screen Capturing Bike Unchained Game Test. Uh, that's because I'm trying out the screen capture feature of the YouTube app, uh, but I kept getting questions on how do you do that? How do you record with the YouTube app? And you don't really record with the normal YouTube app. You have to download the YouTube gaming app, the one that looks like a little heart, that one. Um, and the game that I'll, I'll be testing is this one right here, which is Game Unchained uh, from Red Bull. So, so let's launch the YouTube gaming app. Make sure you're logged into your account, the one that you want to stream games to or post videos to. Uh, click right here and here it says go live. Click go live. And right here, what's so cool about this uh, screen capturing uh, function from YouTube is that you have two options. You either can screen capture the recording and then post the video later on, right? Or you could go ahead live. If you go live, keep in mind that everything that happens on the screen will be recorded and transmitted live on YouTube. So if somebody calls you and there's a phone number, boom, that number, everybody's going to see it. If you get text messaging, everybody's going to see your text messaging. Uh, um, everything that sh uh, noise around you, everybody's going to hear it. So keep that in mind. But the great thing is that you can actually choose from 720 to 480p. Um, I actually prefer to screen capture. This is my, my preferred option uh, because if I do mistakes, I can go ahead and start all over again and then I could uh, like control the volume again and say, no, nah, let me go ahead and uh, uh, try again with a different audio level and all that. So I rather do the screen capture, but it's cool that you can live stream as well. So I'm going to be doing that once in a while. Um, so here, what's cool about this is that when you choose 720, um, it tells you that this device has enough storage to record 700 minutes in this format. That's awesome. That's awesome that it's actually telling you that. Uh, if you put it in 480, I have over 1700 minutes, 1751. That's amazing. So right now I'm going to go ahead and try 720p, right? And I'm going to go ahead and hit record, hit next. Uh, here, there's a couple tips here and there, so you can uh, learn, know. Uh, it says right here, the mic captures the out the game audio from the speaker, so turn up the sound. Now, hold up on that. Do not turn up the sound of the game, because if you do, remember, the microphone of your phone is going to be right here. Most of the time, it's going to be in the bottom, and most of the times, the speaker is going to be in the bottom as well, or here nearby the microphone. If you put the if you put the game level at halfway or above, um, you're not nobody's going to be able to listen to your voice when you're talking. If that's what you want, you cannot put this game. All the way up like it says right there do not do it all the way up um, I recommend to put the audio level very low uh, for example I will put the level uh, I will put the game level that low honestly if you want to capture the game audio plus capture your voice clearly I would honestly put the level no more than that here or there here or there honestly if you put it halfway i've tried it before and it sounds horrible because your voice is trying to compete with the uh, volume of the game and you don't want that you don't want that so that's my advice if, if you want to follow it good if not that's on you uh click next right here you're going to choose any game that you want any game that you want if you don't see the game there click here all apps and now you can see every single app that you have installed every single app but we're going to go ahead and choose this one it's going to say youtube gaming will stop capturing your everything displayed on the screen blah 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 don't show again blah, blah, blah. start now so now the good thing is that it's not really capturing right now so it, it only captures when you hit the record button this right here you can move it around Click right there. And like you see here, what's so cool about this, let's go and zoom in a little bit more. 
what's so cool about this is that you have the front facing camera is actually capturing your image your face and there's two arrows there you can if you click on those arrows you can actually apply filters to your face like you see there, I'm applying filters to my face. That's very cool. Um, here you got, um, you can see the level of the audio. It's picking up your audio. Um, here, make sure you, like I said, make sure you put this game low. Because if you put it high, it's not going to recognize, it's not going to listen to your voice. It's, the game is going to be so loud because the, the speaker is right next to the, to the microphone it's 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 not gonna be worth it so let's go ahead let's go ahead and leave it like that um here you got the option to if you don't want the camera recording your face you could go ahead and turn it off and like you see there you have only the image of your profile which is cool as well that's good that's good because it also drains less battery because uh, if you have both things running at the same time and you have a device not capable of you know not more than three gigabytes i honestly recommend to turn it off if your phone does not have three gigabytes or more, turn it off. And, and that way your gameplay would be a little bit more smoother. But I'm going to leave it on. Uh, here is the mic. If you turn off the mic, it's obviously not going to record your game. So keep it like that. And that's it. Once you hit the record button, it's going to start recording. So let's go and click right there. Right there, you have a countdown. And now it's recording your voice as you play this game. So right now, if I want to start a gameplay here, tap right there, tap right there, tap right there. Uh, keep in mind, you might not listen to the audio of the game too much because, of course, it's low and you're sitting a little bit. Your face is a little bit away from the from the screen of your phone, right? But believe me, guys, the microphone is actually picking up the audio of the gameplay. And if we keep on playing, I'm going to keep on playing here a little bit, right? So you can see right now you might not listen to anything here while I'm, uh oh, <laughs> I almost fell there. But you will notice that after we're done, the audio of the game is going to be very clear because the microphone, like I said, is right next to ah crap <laughs> oh man let's go ahead <laughs> okay uh too late okay no that's not too late okay and this game is pretty cool this game i already posted a video on my channel so go ahead and watch that video so you guys can see how good the audio of the microphone sounds right and how good the mic uh the microphone um damn see what i'm saying i can't Okay, I keep pulling some lame ass, uh, lame ass tricks here. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, baby. Woohoo! Yeah, baby. Okay, and voila. So now we finished gaming, right? So let's say, okay, look at this. Uh, finish didn't didn't complete it. Uh, but let's say we're done with the gaming, right? Let's go ahead and click uh, here, right? And click stop. Let's go ahead and click stop. Now, since we're screen capturing, not live streaming, you're gonna it's gonna take you right here, where you will be able to upload the video directly from the YouTube app. That's awesome. Uh, keep in mind, if you don't decide to upload it right away, you can, uh, it's gonna be saved to a folder in your gallery. Make sure you look for it. Uh, but you can, from here, you can actually um, apply some filter if you want. And let's go listen to the audio of the game and to see how good it picked up my voice and how good it picked up the uh, the audio of the game. Uh, let's go ahead and up the volume now. Now we could go ahead and up the volume because we want to listen to the recording. And let's go ahead and play it. And now it's recording your vo okay. voice as you play this game. So right now, if I want to start a gameplay here... Tap right there, tap See? right there, tap right there. Uh, keep in mind, you might not listen to the audio of the game too much because, of course, it's low and you're... We keep on playing. I'm going to keep on playing here a little bit. Okay. So you can see right now... So, you might like you can see, like here. you can hear, well, I'm, oh, you I'm hear my voice, which comes out very, very clearly, uh, and you also can listen to the game... 
audio as well so that's what you want that's what you want if you think that the audio of the game is not too loud you know you want the audio of the game a little bit more louder you can go ahead and up the volume a little bit more and once you find the proper uh, uh, audio level that you want from the game, from there on, it's going to be easy. From there on, you will be able to record gameplays without messing too much with the audio or of the game. So like you see there, you can listen to my voice and you can listen to the game as well. Um, and that's the same volume. That's the same volume from here. Like I said before, that's the same volume that I uploaded the video before this one. I'm going to leave a link in my description and you can listen to my voice and you can listen to the vo to the audio of the game. And it sounds good. It sounds, you know, for me, it sounds good. So from here, you could go ahead and enter a title. Boom, boom, boom. Enter a title there. Um, and then here you could go ahead and enter description. From here, you could go ahead and enter public, unlisted or private. I would go ahead go private first right that way when you upload the video you can check it before you put it public so make sure you do that tags make sure you tag your video properly make sure you enter the title of the game the racing game you put your name whatever you want to go there so the people will be easier to find the game or your video make sure you put the proper tags as much tags relevant to the video and that's it once you're done click here which is the upload button and look at that the video is uploading right now to youtube of course this is private so i really don't care so once it's up i'll just delete it but that's the thing that's the that's how easy it is to capture videos using the youtube gaming app this is the video that i said i recorded right and uh, if i go over here right let's go and see the gameplay See, you can listen to the game, and you look. At, you can listen to my voice. And that's what you want. That's what you really, really want to do uh, when you're recording a video for YouTube, because you want people to listen to your voice and to the game at the same time. But you don't want your voice fighting with the volume of your game. So that's a good tip to follow. Keep that in mind. And that's it. That's how you record gameplay from your smartphone and post it on YouTube very, very easily. Thanks to YouTube, they made this very easy. Uh, I think this is in beta. It says beta there, but it's working very good. And there's, of course, there's a lot more updates coming up. Um, if your phone is not capable of, you know, if it doesn't have like more than two, three gigabytes, I would not use the front facing camera because you would be forcing the phone, you know, to record gameplay, play a game, plus record your, your image. So that's three things the phone will be doing if your phone is not capable of it. So if I would, if I would you guys and you have a phone that's it's not a three gigabytes, I would test it out first, do a, a couple testings, you know, a couple off, you know, not online. Cause when, she, when you do stream, streaming, people are just gonna criticize you. If you put a crappy video online, people are just gonna criticize you. You don't want that. You, you wanna test it first before you upload it and make it public. So um, that's it guys. If you have any other questions, go ahead and ask and I'll be happily to answer. And maybe if I don't answer, a lot of other um, followers will also answer your questions. Um, let me know what you guys think about this video and let me know what you think about this app because I think YouTube, Google made an awesome app and gave the YouTube gaming app an awesome update with this screen capture and live streaming app. Uh, it works very good. Thanks for watching the video, guys. I hope this helps you guys. Till next time.